Hi guys. So today we're gonna make some so warming jumpin' jambalaya soup. Yes. So for our meat, you're gonna need some sliced smoked sausage, your favorite, some cut up bite-sized pieces of chicken, and some raw deveined shrimp. You're also gonna need some diced onion, a diced green and red bell pepper, a diced jalapeno and some minced garlic. You're also going to need a can of crushed tomatoes, some chicken broth, a little bit of all-purpose flour, and one cup of white rice. Now to start out this recipe, we're going to add a little bit of olive oil to our pot. We're going to throw in our sausage and our chicken. And we're going to let that cook and start to brown. Next, we're going to go ahead and add in our diced onions and our bell peppers. I don't like celery, so if you want to add celery, you would add it in here. I'm going to let that start to cook down until the bell pepper and onion get nice and soft. And then we're going to go ahead and throw in that diced jalapeno. We're going to let this continue to cook for a minute or so. And then we're going to go ahead and add in all of our lovely minced garlic. I love garlic, you guys. Now after everything is nice and soft, we're going to go ahead and add in our flour. This is going to help to thicken our soup. So you want to let that cook till it starts to get nice and brown. After that, we're going to go ahead and add in our chicken broth. And make sure you blend that well. So next, we're going to go ahead and add in our crushed tomatoes. So now it's time to season this up. I'm going to add in some bay leaves, some Cajun seasoning, a little bit of smoked paprika, some thyme, onion powder, garlic powder, um, some dried parsley flakes, um, maybe a little bit of oregano. You guys know me. <laughs> I could ruin the whole kitchen cabinet, but I'll make sure to leave all the seasonings I used in the description box. So after you season it, you're going to go ahead and stir all that in. It smells amazing, you guys. So good. So now that it's almost done, we're going to go ahead and add in our shrimp. Because you know shrimp doesn't take any time to cook. It cooks super fast. So now you guys might be saying, where's the rice? So after reading all of the reviews, I decided to cook my rice separately and I'm going to add it in at the end. So the rice isn't mushy or, you know, so it's perfect al dente white rice. It's so good, you guys. I definitely suggest cooking your rice separate and then adding it in at the end. Yeah. This soup is so delicious, warm and cozy and filling, a little spicy. Just add a scoop of rice. Yum.